Let's talk about manual sex. You mean hand jobs? Well, yeah, that's that's a. I love hand jobs. I, I love giving and receiving. Right, They're right, great, here's, but here's, here's the so thing. much fun. I remember when I was young, and this is in high school, that I had this marvelous boyfriend. Bob, bless you, Bob. <laughs> and he'd drive by late in his dad's yellow coupe, and I'd quite sneak down the stairs. So romantic. I, I got to tell you, it really. And is. in my pajamas, and sometimes a robe. If it was warm weather, I didn't put a robe on. It was just my jammies. And I remember I had the ones that tied up, and so my middle was free, and it was very easy to get inside my oh, jammy Easy access. Pants. Yes, easy access. Your jammy jams. <laughs> and it was so erotic. I tell you, it was some of the best sex of my entire life. I feel like we rushed to vaginal penis penetration please, too please. much. We, we, first of all, we don't have the opportunity to explore our own genitals sufficiently. Yeah, we're not masturbating. And if we were doing that... Then we could better communicate yeah. to other people yeah. how to. So, what do you do when someone's giving you a hand job, but it's a little too much pressure, or it's just too sensitive, or they're just not doing it right? How do you tell someone? You just pick a heavy object up and bam! <laughs> <laughs> no, just kidding. No, no, no. no, no, no. Uh, there are a lot of ways you can tell them. You can reach you know, nonverbal. If you can go nonverbal, it's I think the it's best. always better. In other words, don't go, ow, that hurts. No. Why are you doing it like that? It's awful. No, just. It's not how your brother did it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're so bad. Just reach over and take their hand mm -hmm. and show them with your hand the kind of pressure you like. Got it? I've always done it where I just move the hand off and my hand's on their hand and then I guide them and show them the stroke. And then I usually do some kind of like constructive, like if you do it like that, I'm going to come my face off. You know what I mean? Uh, that's, yeah. You know, a little incentive. In incentive and, uh, yeah, appreciation. I remember that's the way I was shown how to do a guy. He he took he put yeah, men his, are good at that. You're he right. put his hand on top of my hand and started to show me what it, you know the the, the and he mm -hmm. when I wasn't holding it tight enough he squeezed my hand in. So that's when you're on the outside of the guy's hand. But in order to do that, he must agree to go limp. Got it. So that the only mm -hmm. pressure is the pressure that you're applying. Because the problem and the complaint for oh, most women I see is you it's you, the men are pressing too firm, too hard, and they go too fast. So this is a spinoff on how they're they're masturbating, and that's well, you're gonna apply what you know. Yeah, but a pussy isn't a penis. It's, it's automatic, different. exactly. I'm getting so many emails from these young women who are taking the, the title of virgin. They're virgins. And they don't want to have sex until it's the one they're going to marry. The right one. And what an agenda to have to go into a dating situation. I mean, I that's kind of scary. I did this in high In the school. 50s. Well, yeah. And this, in a way, this is worse than the 50s because she's, uh, they go out and they kiss and they, uh, and he, play, he plays with her, her breasts boobs. and she gives him a hand job, which is where we started. It's like, our breasts are our sex symbols, and your sex symbol is your penis. Is your penis, boys? You know. So here we are. Ours are tits. Yours are, are dicks. And and your dick works, and you'll get somewhere with it. But you can rub on a titty for three days, and you, you know nothing's going to happen. Now I have to always do the caveat. There are a handful of women that yes. do come from breast stimulation. Well, Boy, gooey for them, you know, it's like... For most of us, you have to go down south. Oh, come on. I think if you're not going to have intercourse, which is not that's the end fine. Though, that's yeah. fine. But do manual sex. Yeah. Share hand jobs. And if you want to, do the oral sex. But I really think manual for quite it's a while. It's the way to go. Because I remember thinking at the time, now I can come from somebody else's hand besides my own. And that's the big kind of hell to get over. Oh, that's that's big. so grown up.